Fuck, that's a hell of a lot of fireworks. All call signs, this is King. Does anyone copy? Over. I hope we can get this thing started. Eric, check this out. Why would there be a machine gun here? It's a World War II model. It ties in with the time the archaeologists were here. What the fuck happened here? September the 24th, 1940. is starting to make me feel a little uneasy. What happened to these guys? Why would they do that? Look at this place. It doesn't add up. I'll take that, thank you. This is king to all call signs. Are you receiving? Over. Come give me a hand with these cans. About time we had a little luck. <sighs> How's the lake holding up? Lake? Oh, you mean the prosthesis. I lost my leg back on the highway. Don't. I still feel guilty. I didn't make it easy on your rage. I know that. You weren't to blame for that crash. Mom, let's get to work. Shine a light on the tank. Oh, shit. 
shit. What's wrong? Fuel tube's worn loose. The damn valve is leaking. Can it be fixed? We have to secure the tube before starting the generator. There's gotta be something here to fix it. You got it? I've got it. Once you said back at the base, you were wrong. It doesn't sound like me. You said nothing had changed between us. But I've changed. All that time spent away from each other. I couldn't stop thinking of you. Don't you feel the same way? Even a little? I meant what I said. It was over between us the minute that truck hit my car. Nothing has changed. That's not how it feels from my side. It's definitely how it feels from mine. Hold the fuel pipe. Hey, give me a hand with this panel. Look at the state of these. They're shot. Feels like so long since we worked on something together. At the same time, feels like yesterday. Why do we leave things like this? I tried. But you made it so hard for me to stay. We should have stuck together. I don't think either of us expected to be out of each other's lives for so long. Past year or so, my head's been buried in Kalis, and I was blind to anything else. Your work is bigger than the both of us. Like, I don't think either of us could have foreseen the impact it would have. Rach. Say what's on your mind. I've missed you, Rach. Like you wouldn't believe. Back then, I don't know, things seemed confused, but now, it just seems simpler. It's the past, Eric. We have to put it behind us and look towards the future. Otherwise, we're just going around in circles. I'm happy to look to that future. That should do the trick. Let's fire up. There's a way in for these people. There's a way out for us. Let's take a look around.
place. From point of defense, this place has some good choke points, but overall, it's a weak setup. something this vast have remained hidden for so long. Do you think CENTCOM is aware of our situation? I'm hoping the pilots got word back. If any of them survive, that is. Eric, take a look at this. You think it still works? Let's find out, shall we? The tape is all tangled up. It's fine, I can fix that. So when did you stop wearing your wedding ring? When did you stop wearing yours? I didn't. Always close to my heart. Stop wearing it the day I left. I've moved on, Eric. I've forgotten what this ring means to me. I want you back, Rachel. You need to let go of it. There's someone else now. I knew it. The bones of this temple are drenched in blood. We have set foot on an uncharted shore and roused something ancient and wicked. A blasphemy that comes in indescribable shapes and forms. For eons we lived as children in this world, unaware of the horrors that slumber beneath our feet. Now we have blindly thrown open the gates to madness. I fear being taken. But I must do what I must. We must seal this place for eternity. For all mankind. Mary. I'm sorry. not supposed to play out like this. Any call signs? This is King. Contact, contact. Taking fire. Just anyone call me. Over. That's Rachel. King, hey, this is Mailman 2 on actual. Say again. Over. 
King to smell meant two and actual how copy over. Damn it. Something simple in this goddamn place? You're not serious. That looks decades old. That's all we have. Can you see him? Yeah, he's coming. nightmare have these luckless souls fallen into? Poor Rachel has been lost to the darkness. What of Jason and Nick? Brothers in arms, but are they really as close as they appear? Or will it be a case of each man for himself? Let's not forget that they've already lost Corporal Merwin to the dark, and the night is still young. Which brings us to Salim. He seems level-headed, an almost reluctant soldier, perhaps. An unwelcome fate now awaits our survivors, trapped beneath the earth, swallowed by the void. One by one, 
their lights will be snuffed out. Unless you can find the means to save them. It's not my place to concern myself with the affairs of others, but it does keep things interesting. I can offer you some words of advice, as long as you are willing to keep this strictly between ourselves. A prudent choice, all things considered. Long ago, I met a blind poet who impressed upon me these wise words. Long is the way and hard, and out of hell leads up to light. That's all for now. Rachel, where is she? Rachel! What happened to Rachel? We, we were ambushed by the enemy. They opened fire on us. And Rachel, she fell. I held on. Held out as long as I could. Rachel! We gotta move. Colonel, we're sitting ducks. We need to fall back now. Over there. Let's go! Oh. Look at that. Be here. Right now, Colonel, the Iraqis are the least of our problems. They're not following. This is Mailman 21 Actual to all call signs. How copy? Over. Joey, report in. Over. Joey's dead. The fuck you talking about? The Iraqis tore right through him. He died in my fucking arms. Oh, no, not Joy. The hell are we gonna get out of this? We gotta lock this place down. Form a defense perimeter and buy ourselves some goddamn breathing space. Lieutenant, what did you mean when you said the Iraqis are the least of our worries? You believe in God? Absolutely not. We'll start believing. We are under attack by... I don't know what. And you wouldn't believe me even if I tried. Hell, I don't believe in those there. Monsters. Monsters? Come on, you're jumping at shadows. Sir, with all due respect... Lieutenant, we're trapped down here with an enemy Iraqi, maybe more. Whatever you think you've seen, it's bullshit. These statues. Nick! Take a mental picture and snap the fuck out of it. What is this place? It's not the silos, that's for sure. This mission's a bust. I can fix this. The satellite. Look over the data to improve the algorithm. They're clearly teething problems. Oh, fuck your satellite. Good men have died. Clarice is gone. Your wife is dead, Eric. You led us on a suicide mission. Hey. I'm still in command here. You'd better remember your rank, Lieutenant. I'll get us out of here. We should move on. Stay and guard the entrance. Go check it out.
So this is Saddam's chemical weapon silo, huh? Run for the fucking hills. We're all doomed. So much for Eric's pioneering thermal satellite system. Eric's gonna have some pretty tough questions to answer. I wouldn't like to be in those shoes. There's the generator. Let's go take a look. Need a hand here? I'm on it. Someone's taking a serious dislike to this thing. Sabotage. Looks it. Watch my back. Ah, shit. Stop fucking around. Hurry up. Does it look like I'm fucking around? Good job, Sergeant. Kick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. We're heading deeper. Over. Acknowledged. You be careful in there. Drop kick out. Cable split. Let's see what they lead to. This way. Step. There's a trip wire. Clear. It looks simple enough. Counter explosion? Nah. Just need to cut the trigger. Gotta be the guy who shot at Eric. Motherfuckers hunting us. Dropkick, this is Mailman 21 Actual. Do you copy? Over. Dropkick receiving. How's it going out there, Kolchak? Your friend sprung an IED on us. We're good. You'll want to keep your eyes open in case he's left any more love notes. Over. Copy that. Moving up. Dropkick out. He's moving up. Shame you warned him about the tripwire. October the 21st, 1946. Crow was the first to break into the tomb, an honor he shared with Bessie, that damned machine gun of his. It was a beast of a weapon, but it seemed to comfort the fellaheen doing the digging. This place has lain undisturbed for centuries. It is not the tomb of Alexander the Great, but a temple of an even older god king, the Akkadian despot, Naram Sin. We have been mistaken, but Lady Bradshaw still declares it a find for the ages, a discovery that will write our names in the annals of history. Looking out at this sceptered hall, I have no reason to doubt her.